Listen, bitch, if you fucking a nigga raw, don't go fucking one of your ex-boyfriends raw, too, and then fucking fuck that nigga that you fucking raw again. Your ex-boyfriend dick is not the same. You haven't seen it in four or five months. No. Then you contaminate everybody, and then y'all all die. You see, Cardi B is a lifesaver. A lot of people like to throw her under the bus. They like to hate on her or whatnot, talk about her teeth, rag on the way that she speaks, or maybe the way she dresses, or maybe even some of her actions, and they like to say all sorts of crazy things about her. But if you really think about it, Cardi B is a very intelligent young lady, and as you can see, <laughs> she's warning you whores out there, you rats, you random ass thoughts, to stop going around and double dicking. You know, you can't be double dick dipping. It's just disgusting. It's just like how if you and your friend were eating chips with dip, you know, you wouldn't want your friend to dip a chip in the dip, bite the chip and dip it back in the dip. So why are you double dipping dicks you nasty random ass thoughts you see i don't personally get it jesus but then again i'm not a whore you know i'm not running around here you know getting rammed in my coochie hole like you are so you know you probably think that that's okay to do but as you can see your girl cardi b let you know you know you going around raw dog in every damn body you might give somebody the cooties the coochie cooties and the coochie cooties are real and they do more than just give you bumps they give you bumps and itches and have you oozing and burning and hurting and whatnot and you up there squirming at work and whatnot trying to s scratch yourself in between your legs with rulers and pencils and trying to be nonchalant about it you keep going to the bathroom because <laughs> you gotta go dab some of that ooze that's coming out of your lower hole. You see, that's why we should all listen to Cardi B and not go around trying to screw everything in the world, be responsible, and then maybe you won't end up with AIDS like some of the nasty fucks that Cardi B is exposing. But anyways, this is all my opinion. A lot of you motherfuckers need to just live in a clinic because you're just filth. But anyways, let me know what you think about it all below. Be sure to subscribe. To the Meat Magazine YouTube channels, visit meatmagazine.blogspot.com. Follow me on Twitter at Meat Magazine. Ladies, have you ever gone from one guy raw dog to another like what Cardi B was talking about? I know most of you have. You'll lie and say that you haven't. We both know that you're nasty. Tell your story below. Meat Magazine. Oh, another thing. I just remember something. A lot of you have lied to the alleged father of your child. And you have him thinking that he's the father when it's some other guy. Maybe even some guy you just met at a club one night that you cheated on in your car. I heard this one woman tell a story like that on a radio show. We know what you women are doing out there. I'm just letting you know. <gasps> tell your story below. Meat Magazine.